Hello, everyone, and welcome to uh, Tabor Talk. I just want to check in for a few minutes here. Um, today is the 20, is it 22nd? Oh, my God, 22nd anniversary of 9-11. I know exactly where I was. I think we all do. I was actually working on Long Island. My wife was in the city. She was not downtown. She was in Midtown. So uh, I remember it like yesterday. And uh, talk about time flying by at 22 years. There are a lot, there are some content creators, young people. Like, is it Michael Knowles? No, maybe not. I think he's a little bit older. But there's some of these people who weren't even alive on 9-11. It's, it's very, very strange. But 22 years, um... I'm just very, very sad. Um, and there you go. And uh, on a positive note, how about them Cowboys? Holy shit. Beat the Giants 40 to nothing. Oh, my God. It wasn't even close. And the sad news, the Yankees did win yesterday, but they lost Jason Dominguez, the Martian, UCL, He's going to be out, you know, you won't see him till like June of 2024. So, um, sorry to mix such a sobering 9-11 and in sports, but there you go. Um, and by the way, this is not really a sports channel. I'm, a, I'm involved with a lot of sports chats. Cowboys, I've been Cowboys, the Yankees, and I like the Nets in basketball. And good thing about sports is you can forget you could take your politics and put it on the shelf. And by the way, we're all brothers. When we're when I'm in the chat, every once in a while you'll see some asshole like, hey, Trump 2024. I'm like, hey, dude, keep your fucking politics out of this crap, right? We are Cowboys fans. Fuck your politics, right? Um, so as I said over and over, good the good thing about sports, when we're we're all brothers in arms, if you will. Um, we're all Cowboys fans when we're in that chat, Yankees fans and Nets fans. And there you go. So nice and short. God bless everyone. Good friends, good books and a sleepy conscience. Peace, love and understanding here in Tabor Talk.